Hello, I'm Dr. Leong. Today, we're going to talk about the pulse oximeter. A pulse oximeter is used to monitor a person's oxygen saturation. It is a small portable device that clips onto the finger and provides a reading in seconds. It is important that you purchase a pulse oximeter that provides an accurate reading. The pulse oximeter shines a light through the finger. Blood absorbs the light and there is a distinct difference between the wavelengths of oxygenated and deoxygenated blood, which the oximeter analyzes to give a result. The pulse oximeter measures the amount of oxygen carried by hemoglobin and this reading is referred to as the SpO2. The normal range for SpO2 is 95 to 100 percent. The pulse oximeter also measures the heart rate at the same time. The normal range for heart rate is 60 to 100 beats per minute. One needs to use the pulse oximeter correctly. Make sure your hands are warm. Number two, make sure there is no nail polish on the nails. The middle finger provides the best reading while the thumb comes next. However, the measured differences between the fingers are marginal and any finger can be used. You may use a finger on the right or the left hand. Place the pulse oximeter properly and securely over the finger and make sure it detects strong pulses from the finger. A regular tall pulse waveform or a blinking green light shown on the device denotes proper placement of the oximeter. Take the SpO2 reading only when the readings have stabilized over several seconds. The SpO2 can be taken at rest or during exercise. If pulse oximeter readings regularly fall below the normal range while you are either at rest or during exercise, you should consult a doctor. Hypoxemia or lack of oxygen in the blood can be due to many medical causes. Both definitive treatment and supplementary oxygen are essential. Oxygen therapy requires a doctor's prescription. Thank you.